Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video and this one is on how to install the DLC of the Isle of Armor as well as the Crown Tundra. So yeah, like, subscribe and comment down below if this worked for you so other people know it's real. If you haven't followed my guide on Pokemon Sword already, please do it before trying this so you know everything works before you do this. Now if you already follow up my guide, you might know that the game version that I provide is 1.0.0 and to make this DLC work, you need version 1.2.0. Now you don't have to reinstall the whole game in version 1.2.0, but you gotta have to update it first. So the link for the update as well as the DLCs and the new prod keys because you have to get the newest prod keys to make this work. And the way to do that is you go to file, open user folder, keys folder, and the prod key should be 10 KB. The previous ones were 9 KB. So yeah, link also for that down in the description. Some links will be zipped, so you'll have to unzip it. But for prod keys, that will not be the case. So just drag and drop it into your Yuzu keys folder. And after you do that, reopen Yuzu if you already open it. Now to install the update, you have to go to file, install files to Nandi and find the update file. Click on it and click open. It will ask you, please confirm these files are the files you want to install. So for now, this is just the update. So you click install and it will say one file successfully installed. Now to install the DLCs, you gotta go to file and install files to Nandi again, but this time you're gonna find the DLC files. So you click on the first one and hold control and click on the other one. Then you click open. Then it will ask you to confirm again and you click install. Now to check if it worked, on the right side under add-ons, you will see the update 1.2.0 and the DLC 1 and 2. Now as you can see I had some mods here but another important note is you have to disable your mods by right clicking on Pokemon Sword, going to properties and unchecking them. Just make sure the update as well as the DLC are checked, click OK and now you can run the game. Now if you go to Wedgehurst Station which is between Route 1 and 2, it will say the train to the Isle of Armor has arrived. So yeah let's just talk to them. Okay, so you gotta talk to the Slowpoke. He'll ask if you're a Pokemon trainer. Then I guess you gotta battle Slowpoke and catch it. All right, so after catching Slowpoke, you talk to this guy and he'll ask you where you would like to go and you just choose Armor Station. And there we go, we're on the island. All right, so here's these updates for Pokedex, etc., etc. But I'm not gonna play because I only play when I live stream. I do live streams helping people and playing Pokemon Sword. So make sure to check those out. As I said at the beginning, if this worked for you, please like, subscribe, comment down below to tell people that it's real and that it worked. And uh, yeah, that's it for me. So peace out, guys. Peace.